All right, welcome back. New episode. Today, I don't know what I'm going to do. Probably try to create a handful of, well, one mining hover, mini hover vehicle appropriate to being stored in a vehicle like this. Um, so we've got six stations, right? So this should be room for six small mining bare bones hovercraft. I think I'm going to make that today. Uh, but first, I'm processing the fuel now, but first I'm going to, uh, let's see, explore over here. Amelon I've never seen before because of the, oh, look at that, it's 3D. I did not know that. Okay, so, yeah, I'll head in that direction. I don't suppose, they, they dropped a hint, the developers dropped a hint that they want the universe to be infinite at some point, so there'll be many systems. I wish that was right now because I want that right now. But at least we'll go to M1, we'll explore real quick, and I'll make myself a mining vehicle, and that will be it for today. Uh, by the way, yes, I found an epic assault rifle in that base I was sort of hauling out. There's so much of that base left. But hey, at least we learned where I learned that if you take out the drone place, they don't, they stop, uh, presumably, actually. I haven't actually learned this, come to think of it. Presumably they stop coming um, to hit your base. Cool. All right, first stop, Venedzar. Bloop. Taking forever. Oh, 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 taking forever. Come on. All right. This is actually a place I might want to stay in the future. In fact, I don't think I've ever been to the moon, but for today, I told you I'd do another thing. So, from here, Amelon. Hello, Emelon, where are you? You're behind me. Oh. So the one problem with this ship is it turns kinda actually fine. <laughs> Compared to other large ships, I assume that's quite fine. Second stop, Amelon. Oh. oh, I got a red red dot in my vicinity somewhere. Where are you, red dot? I don't see you. Hmm. Well, Amelon looks similar to the last one, and the Amelon's moon looks similar to the last moon, too. Hmm. Let's see. What does it say? Gosh, that red thing is close to me. Hmm. Amelon is a what? Amelon moon is a what? Hmm. Hmm. No, seriously, where are you, red dot? Alright, I'm gonna... Hey, is gravity finally working? Cool. Hello. Ah, that was a problem last time. All right, let's take a quick look at... Oh, I still need a, a lid on this thing. Um, where are you, red dot? Where? Oh, you know what? Oh, I do have ammo. Okay, good. Does anybody see it? Let's take out our little peon little ship here and go for it more directly. Where are you? Where are you, red dot? How do I find you? Oh, there you are. Once again, the drones don't seem to be terribly active. Hard at all. So this system may not be a high level area. No, don't slow down. Don't slow down. You're slowing down. Uh, yeah, I don't. For physics says you shouldn't do that. I'm just saying. Almost there. I like being able to drift through space without the consumption of energy. This is most efficient. I'm gonna need oxygen too. I don't know if this ship. I'm pretty sure I put some oxygen in this ship. Oof. Gosh, that looks too different. The transition still needs work. It's better than it was, but it definitely still needs work. So yes, it's on an icy planet. Oof. I don't know 
what there is to go looking for, but I guess we don't really need to care a whole lot. Oh! I see a base of some kind. Polaris territory, you know what? That's friendly, it's fine. I'm, I'm okay with that. Let's go ahead and land next to our Polaris friends here. Oh, looks like our Polaris friends, though, have been harassed. Come on, take it out, take it out. Without hitting them. Without hitting them. Gosh, is this, how tough is this thing? It's taking a lot of punishment. There you go, there's one. Number two? Ooh, number two is a little more dangerous. Oh, maneuvering this ship is not the easiest thing. It has a lot of inertia. Where'd you go? Oh, there it is. My sense of scale is all wrong now. Oh my gosh, the inertia. Let's just land. All right, shoot it. No, nope, not quite landed. Hey, 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 be nice. Let's tilt upwards. <laughs> uh, this is a little lame, especially since I can't even hear what it's doing. Oh. Wow, how tough is this thing? Do not shoot me. Alright. Oh gosh, there's people on the ground too. Oh. Alright. It was... Oh gosh. <laughs> ah, such a long flat ship and like two legs actually have actually connected to the ground. All right, but still, interesting. Transport hub, big old moon in the sky, nice scenery, very nice. I could see setting up here for a little while, but today let's just design a new hovercraft. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Uh, okay, not so bad, okay. Alien ice golem, huh? Oh, rich, what, what? Somebody took a pot shot at, eh? Oh, who? Oh! Wow! I did not expect to see this. This world is actually a little bright. Easier to see this one. Are you taking shots at my ship? This while I was just still building supplies I needed to start a hovercraft. And actually replenish the ammo. Good, good. Oh gosh, what? Another one? I thought this was Polaris territory. What is going on here? Yep, it did. Oh, by the way, I also meant to get some uh, some of this going. All right, so well, nope, wrong one. If you wouldn't mind getting started, I could always use more oxygen. All right, what have you got for me? I'll take it. Those are quite valuable. I still need to figure out. By the way. What ammo these guys need? Because they have yet to fire on anything. All right, here we go. Created new hub vessel. Uh, like I said, this thing needs to be pretty minimalist. Pre oh, you know what? I need a, a cockpit. Uh, let's see. I think SV, HV. This is mostly SV. Oh, okay, where is it? Is it this one? Fortunately, these things can't normally be labeled. All right, so all of these things are related in some way to... Oh, look. Oh, I'm stupid. Okay, well, that's fine. That's fine. All right. Uh, let's see here. Hover uh, Engine 2x2. Two two. Oh, you know what? I still need that cockpit. Uh, let's get that made right. Oh, we're still working on ammo, are we? Oh, for crying out loud, here we go again. 
Stop. Stop. Yes. Shoot at me instead. Shoot at me instead, not my ship. Uh, is there another one out there? I haven't even gotten started yet. All right. First up, this craft is not supposed to be a combat ship. It is purely for labor. Oh, is this one of the twos? Yeah, I hate these. I like the I like that they're so forward and narrow, but uh, it doesn't really do me any. No, nope, that's what I wanted. Any favors in terms of other things, but this this off this affords uh, high visibility, but it's not it's not like extraordinarily armored or anything. And you know what? Can I I cannot put a second one because I don't like the position of this. I'm just gonna take that back. Put this right in the middle. Okay, so now we've got to have a craft again. Very good. Um, of great import, these guys are real workers. These, these things exist for the purpose of doing real work. So we're going to... Hmm. Right. Oh, you know what? This would work better if I uh, put the... Uh, Symmetry on. Sorry, you know, it's actually been like a few weeks since I last played. All right, so these are already pretty powerful, but any more than two is overkill for what is supposed to be a very small craft overall. Um, it does need ample storage space, and that storage space needs to be accessible, so we'll keep it up here. All right. And, like I said, ample storage space, so we'll put in lots of extenders here. Extender, extender. So this guy can carry quite a lot in the way of uh, that stuff. Well, morning is here, as are some nasty spider things. Arachnid, indeed. Oh, come on. Whoop, I missed. Alright, good riddance. Right, I'm not sure. I need more space back here, do I not? I think I'll take these off too. I'm not sure 100% what I need. Uh, yes, come on, come on. Finish up. One of those is probably actually as much as I was hoping for. Because uh, I wanted one... Front. I, I sort of like this triangular business right here, though it doesn't appear. If I do that, it doesn't appear to ta attach to anything. So, hmm. That's kind of questionable. Actually, oomph, oomph. I, I do wish they looked more like they attached to things. They kind of do from the top, but that's about it. Um, let's set that aside for a brief moment, and let's see here. Yes, I am going to need some of these. I took off some of the container extensions, but that's okay, because I need a fuel tank, and I need a, this guy here. So, hmm, perhaps this stuff can go elsewhere after all. So let's put... This well protected under no, that's the fuel tank. Let's put the fuel tank. So that's tough. That's tough. What does my oxygen tank look like? Oh, it's small. I, I want to keep this thing short, you know, short and stubby if I can help it. But we need access to the ox the fuel tank from somewhere reasonable. Hmm. Hmm. Gosh, I'm not sure now. I suppose if it sticks all the way out like this... Oops. There we go. It can be received from the back. Then we have room for our engine. That can go underneath. Right, so now it can take fuel. Now I want these sort of... 
go further back, which I think does mean I can... <sighs> not sure, not sure. Maybe... Oh gosh, that goes all the way back, doesn't it? Okay. I mean, I like to a certain extent what's going on back here, but... I think it needs to be f further up. Uh, that's pretty freaking far up if I do that. Hmm. Let's do that. This buys us some space. Perhaps we'll go with a forward triangle instead. Ah, let's just get rid of all of it. Sorry, this is going to take a few rounds to get just right. Okay, how about that? Just raw, raw rawness. Before I go and do anything, I do need oxygen. I do want access to oxygen, so we'll put that... Well, we still need access to... other things here. We need access to ammo. Well, no we don't. This is not a fighting craft. But do we need oxygen on both sides? I don't think so. We do need to restore our containers, though. Do we want one on either side? I suppose we don't. No, I don't think we do. Um, I don't. I think that would confuse it. So how about we just put it here? Um, yeah, I still see some of these. These cannot be anything else, can they? Okay. So if they cannot be anything else, then we can do something like this. Let's still hide it pretty well. Oh, I don't know. Let's just do it for now, and we'll come back to it later if it seems like there's a reason to. I'll put that away. Got forward, side to side, and we don't need to worry about down. Uh, where'd the containers go? Manage, put in a little bit of fuel. Whoa, whoa, ho, ho, ho. All right, so it is a little lopsided, I think. All right. Whoop. Yep, it's a bit lopsided towards the back. No, and despite the position of it, it now leans too far forward. Actually, let me get to stop wasting power. Still, like, it affords me the opportunity to uh, flesh out what's going on under here. As soon as I can. My problem is the angle's not great for doing that. Ah, better. Whoa! Fast! Alright, uh, I can't see with all this stuff in front of me. Off. Turn that off. Very good. All right. Yeah. It's quite, quite maneuverable. Kind of looks like an industrial vehicle. Oof! This thing goes side to side very fast. This slows down fast. Oh yeah, this thing, this little miner should be a fair pleasure to operate. Now let's take, oh, whatever the heck that was. Boop. Let's uh, take a quick look at how many of these are likely to fit in here. So, oh, that's unexpected. How is that possible? That can't be. No, it is possible. Well, no, it is. Okay, so it literally can fit right here. And I could just have three by three. Well, turning around is a problem, though. One would have to back up into such a spot, but we could do that. So, yeah, you back right in, right next to your pod, right? And... 
Cool. There's plenty of room for these things. Okay, so this is pretty... Pretty much good. Pretty sure there was a... Oh, wait, there was. But it's inside their territory, so let's go off in a new direction and find something to mine real quick. Right. There's still a little bit of an off-kilter business here. You see it starting to lean forward? Yep. Oh, I was afraid that was going to happen. Oh. oh, but I got out better than... or more easily than I used to be able to. Okay. Still, it doesn't seem to happen on land, but over water it tilts forward, so that's a thing to consider. A couple of undesirables here and an engine compartment. I'm just going to zip right past them. Things fast. By the way, how do you like the lights? There's a couple of custom... They're not headlights in the traditional sense. They're just a couple of uh, standard lights that have been given a sort of a cone. 40 degree cone on either side. But they're not too obtrusive, which is what I like. Okay, okay. Neodymium. Neodymium. Yeah, that's correct. I'm actually very low on food, so I'm not going to spend more than a real second. But I want to see this work. Okay. Actually, it's strikingly slow. Come on. I expected more. Maybe that's because I'm spoiled on this epic thing. You know, by any normal... What was that? Hey, 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 don't be mean. Oh well, you saw it work, so there you go. I'll make a few more, well, I may not make a few more of these. That one, you know, I'm the only one on my own damn little ship, so I'll probably only have one, but the f full crashed capital vessel, very cool. Um, where am I? Hey look, I'm going entirely the wrong way. Okay, so, yeah. Um, yep, that's it, I gotta get home. All right, I'll see you guys next time.